going to be talking about the evolution of educational technologies. All right, so the horn book is the earliest form of technology. It was constructed in order to hang on the belts of children so that they could easily access the alphabet. Um, there would also be a religious saying on the slab since back then religion was a major part of education. The Magic Lantern is the first projector ever used. It projected images from glass plates and could only be used in a dark room. The images were hand painted and deteriorate, deteriorated quickly. These were widely used and the Chicago public schools had around 18,000 lanterns in their classrooms. Chalkboards were initially made of actual slate or pieces of wood coated with paint and grit. Slate is a fine grained rock with frequent mica and quartz inclusions. The slate material splits and cleaves readily into thin slabs. Slate occurs in various colors, primarily blue, green, gray, and black, with darker slates caused mainly by carbon presences. Most boards are now made of metal coated, special porcelain based paint since actual slate is very heavy and somewhat expensive. The chalk is rubbed against a surface that is rough enough to transfer the white pigment of the chalk onto the blackboard. Circa 1890. So that's our presentation. Um, we have a small video that we'd like to show you guys about how technology is changing education. Thank you, Molly. Can technology change education? Yes. Yes. I like you guys already. <laughs> <laughs> so this is an image from the late 60s of a CDC plateau. And for some of you that may recognize that, it's one of the first computer-assisted learning systems that ran on a mainframe, and it was delivering about 20 lessons on a mainframe. So big idea, but perhaps not so big impact. So certainly, technology has changed tremendously in the last 50 plus years. And there have been many initiatives that have tried to use technology to change education, some very visible, like the one laptop per child. But most would believe that technology has failed to meet some of the expectations. I firmly believe that technology can transform learning. I really believe it can. I do know that there are a few myths and a few barriers about what it might take to change education. changes the solution. In the TED Talk, there was a huge emphasis on changing our thinking about technology in order to integrate it in better ways into the classroom. Technology has the ability to individualize learning for every student. It is just a matter of finding a way to implement it properly. From the horn book to the computer, the magic lantern to the powerful Hubble telescope, or the chalkboard to the iPad. Never in the history of this planet has the evolution of technology in the classroom been so profound. The advancements of technologies are not only profound, but are necessary to accommodate the needs of students in order to prepare them to meet the needs of their respective societies. All right, we hope you guys enjoyed our presentation. Thanks for watching.